I feel like it's sloppy, so. That's honestly like how we prefer it. Yeah. <laughs> Dirty and sloppy. Hot these sloppy. Fucking, what are these characters? <laughs> uh, that's that's Team Supersonic Racing. <laughs> Can I be on that team? I mean, you have to ask your oh my teammate. God. What are these? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Chad. Oh, there's, there's the Chad. <laughs> Chad. The Chad's. Chad. Chad's. The Chad's. Johnny Bravo is a Chad, I get it. Yeah, that makes perfect sense. <laughs> <laughs> Who's the guy in the middle? Oh, that's a Chad Coon. Nice. <laughs> this is like... <laughs> oh, the vampires? <laughs> Do you know the way? Or the transvestites. <laughs> I think it's the no, vampires. vampires. Yep. Yep. <laughs> the goths. It's a strawd in the strawds. Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> the what? Is that a JoJo reference? Oh, no, it, no, it's a Crystal Strahd reference. But there is a JoJo's reference in there. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. So. <laughs> I'll let you guys handle the music because I didn't even get I didn't even touch the music stuff, so oh, cool. just load up what you think it's on loop. Okay. Yes. <laughs> I'm cool with it. So All does right. it matter which character I play and does it matter the level of the character? Um not really. Pick pick what feels right. <laughs> I'm kinda sad I didn't in Fourth character, I'm, uh, the other character. It's not too late. <laughs> you can do it. Whatever. He's a level Whatever. higher than us, and he's a stat rolled character, so I don't know. Yeah. The, do stats he's matter. Gregory, the ma he's the <laughs> Grigori, the mad uh, drunk monk. Ooh. Last that call and put him in 20. if you want. Ah, uh, I don't. What you going with, Ryan? I'll just go with Palouse. His voice is easier to do. There we go. I have never heard <laughs> really? your cream voice. Do the cream voice real quick. I can't. It's over. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I can do it. Alright, so... <laughs> you guys had set up for camp a few hours ago, and just at some point... You all finally woke up in this strange yet hospitable room, filled with various other groups. The fuck are these assholes? Artemis, you set up another spa day. You're just going crazy lately. Uh, does this look like a spa to you? <laughs> it's a very I mean, yeah, of course. Another spa day. <laughs> it could. You're Anything telling for me my most, friends. most spas don't have chains on the walls? Well, I mean, maybe not the spas you go to. Well, maybe the spas I go to. Mm -hmm. I don't know about those spas. Trust me, Flegathan spas always have chains on the walls. Right. Well, they have a very oh, weird yeah. definition of happy ending. Shit happens. Always remember you're safe. Are we RPing right now? Yes, we are. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> Maybe? <laughs> Maybe we're discovering more about each other than we ever thought we would before. So there are these other teams in the room? Yes, and they're all kind of milling about themselves. They look... They all look confused as well. Like, they... <laughs> it seems that they... Don't know why they're here either. <laughs> hmm. I will approach the vampires. Uh, be careful. They might Gentlemen! fight! Gentlemen, how's, how's it going? Don't worry, these so, guys are suckers. Salutations! <laughs> I see that you also fancy the black dress. Uh, I, I think of it more as a suit. Oh, you oh you mean clothing. Okay. Yes! How, how many fingers am I holding up? I, I show four three? fingers. You are holding up three fingers. One, <laughs> two, three fingers. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, yeah, 
Bated. <laughs> yes, baited. That's right, honey. Oh, Josh, you. <laughs> so, what brings you, uh, interestingly just uh, dressed gentleman, to this lovely room? Well, that's the strangest thing of it. I was just sitting in my coffin, and all of a sudden I woke up in here along with a few other gentlemen that, after talking with them a little bit, it seems that they are also Strahds from, possibly, other worlds. Here we have Frankenstrahd. Hello, friends. We also have Nick Strahdless Cage. Yeah, hello. <laughs> In this one, he seems to speak a language I do not understand. Come up, Strahdada! <laughs> See, it's, he just yells a lot. I do not understand him. I like them. I like I the Muppet Strahd. <laughs> <laughs> does anyone does anyone know comprehend languages? Maybe that'll help us understand it. Nope, we're definitely fucked on this one, darling. Okay. I'm more concerned about the weird bald man and his assortment of horrifying I creatures. I think I will they're recommend adorable. Them. Look at them. What are those people doing over there with the yellow hair? Mainly they're just preening amongst themselves, flexing their muscles and covering themselves in oil. <laughs> I agree! Yes, I agree, honey! <laughs> your your Strahd sounds like he's also like my waiter at an Italian restaurant. Anyway, I love it. <laughs> yes, we've been here for a few hours at most, and you seem to be the newest ones here. We're still trying to gather what's going on. I just assume that this is a spa, and um, we're here for very elaborate treatment. Look, spaghetti. Hmm. Spaghetti? <laughs> <laughs> I hope there's no garlic in there. Uh, how can you have spaghetti without garlic? Are you not a fan of garlic? Garlic hey, makes everything bro, better. Garlic's good for your antioxidants. <laughs> you hear this call out from the table of yellow haired gargantuan delight. <laughs> Of oh, course. these guys look like assholes. Hey, man, are you on? Like... I feel like that's a little judgmental, bro. I mean, but you're free to have your own you know, opinions about things. I feel like Sabellin would get along well with them. That's a good point. I haven't seen him. I would think he's... Yeah, where is he Sable? Uh, have any of you seen a black dragon bone six feet tall? Generally, it looks like he's not sure where he is at any given point. Adorable. Oh, does someone say adorable animals? Sounds like a quite a fit one of my machines. <laughs> you hear this strange bald man quite poorly call it from the last table. You stay at that table with your weird animals. I no, kind of no, want to pet them. Here. Can I go pet I them? I like animals. Come here. Before you even notice, before you can even comprehend, <laughs> the blue one is right next to you. Cool. Jesus. Oh, look John at go, him. Cool. What's the you, look, Can you teach me that move? <laughs> sure thing, Gus. Just give me a cute chili dog that will cook you right up. <laughs> <sighs> what is a chili dog? Why are your legs so skinny? <laughs> the best running, bro. <laughs> Got a speed, Jeed. Now, if I Very poke cute your hair... I don't understand the words coming out of your mouth. Now do people do? Wow! Good, I think. <laughs> this guy's clearly juiced. Anyway. Last processing, and he zooms back to his table. <laughs> um. Okay. It was nice meeting you. I think. I like them. And they're spunky. And then you hear a door open from the other side of the room—a door that you're pretty sure wasn't there before—and out of it strides an ancient-looking man. <laughs> Hello, everybody! I see you've all been gathered here today for s some of the festivity! Palouse, whatever you do, don't go with that man if he says he wants to perform an operation on you. Just saying. What? Don't worry about it. He's okay. holding a microphone with a very long string that goes back into the room he came out of, and he kind of points it towards you, Palouse, and towards the animals over the far table. Oh, I've got my eye on all of you. But anyways, it is time 
Oh, yeah, yes, no, no interrupting the show, young man. But I have to ask, aren't you feeling happy? Of course I'm feeling happy. I'm always happy before a show. So is this oh, like a cool. spa show? Are we all going to like, um, like a, like a runway yeah. walk down? No? That, oh, there'll be lots of running. I assure you that. Oh, no. Oh, this boy. is like the that. great room before <laughs> the show starts. So the show is starting quite soon. And if you'd like to take this moment to pick up some sponsors for the show, that might garner some favor with the audience and the ever-present sponsors. All right, all right. Uh, I still don't understand half the words coming out of your mouth. That's all natural. That's completely to be expected. Cool. <laughs> well, well, sir. Uh, did you? What's your name? You can call me Rob Marker. All is right, this, Mr. This... Mr. Marker. Uh, Mark. Excuse me. That is not his name. Are no, the sponsors? Eh? Is this good sponsor music? Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> Love it. Love it. <laughs> well, sponsored by Gillette Razors. <laughs> some of the sponsors you can pick today are Hecka Cola, the only cola made by the Hells themselves, Baylor Mayo, a fine sandwich bread made by Baylor's, and I, could, I didn't think of any other sponsors besides that. Make some up yourselves. <laughs> Did you know that they, in in one of the layers of hell, they make you gargle that mayonnaise? I'm oh, going to no. go with Heca Cola. I'm pretty sure Heca Cola he makes other great products like uh, Heca Sprite. Oh, they just call that with... Spite down here. I want to go with spite. the local razor. Liquid Spite. <laughs> <laughs> really um... thirst quenching. Jiagra? I'll choose Jiagra. <laughs> Jiagra it is! Woke razors! Woke razors! I want those! <clears throat> Woke razors. Woke ra- Alright, let me go with him. Write this down in some notes real quick. So, Agony's going for Liquid Spite. Artemis is going for Heca Cola. <laughs> Palouse is going for Woke razors. And John is going for. What was Jiagra. it? Jiagra. 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 If you feel its effects for more than four hours, contact the nearest cleric. <laughs> I, I have a question. Can I... You say... Can we get multiple sponsorships? You get as many sponsorships as you can fit logos on your clothes. Oh, good. Mm. Glad um, i I'll also get a, a, uh, a sponsorship from Clean and Revivify. I just want to get as many sponsors as I can figure out to make into a funny statements on my clothes. So I want to get all of them and then You're use them to create the logo sentences. To spell <laughs> yes, love it. Crap! I don't have fake sponsors. <laughs> all righty, here are our sponsors today: Liquid Spite, Coca Cola, Elusive Clean, Revivify, Woke Razors, and Gigantra. <laughs> Beautiful. All right. Who's ready to get to the field of quadruple quandary? Is there free drinks? <laughs> sure. Is that what this is? Why yes. am I not on the field as well? Should I have dropped my own token? Uh, probably because I didn't okay, know to no, drop your token. I just wasn't paying attention. <laughs> All of a sudden, I looked and everyone else is there. <laughs> I, just, I just threw my guy on there. I saw everybody else doing it, and I just wanted to be cool. <laughs> Alright, but for, before we can get to the game, you have to get there. And to do that, moving all to a new page. <gasps> Let's see here. We populate this bad boy real quick. <laughs> <laughs> We play banjo again. Yeah, the vet was totally wrong. You're not tired at all after that shot. 
I have a cat running around my bed, circles, wanting me to play with it. Tell her to calm down. That's very, very difficult. She's only nine weeks old. You can figure it out. Oh god, there's both of y'all. Ha! Ah. No, we're a little too much to handle at times, aren't we? <laughs> oh, that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> great, They're great. multiplying! <laughs> we're gonna win this for sure. <laughs> we have way more people. Alright, how the hell do you start an initiative? Because we're doing it. Okay, uh, okay. okay. Uh, all you do is, uh, let's see. Uh, Hit the clock on the left. Press, yeah. press the button. <laughs> ha! Okay. So, we, are we rolling? Yeah, go for it. Should I play something different? Uh, yes. Listening to Numa Numa currently. Yes. Do that one. Oh god, I didn't make these guys tokens. Ah. <laughs> How do you just... <laughs> mm. uh, yeah. Just roll d20s. Uh, for their initiative, and uh, all you gotta do then is click on their tokens, like right click on it, and add it turn. Aha. Uh -huh. Damn. No. Do a shorter one. There's gotta be a shorter one. Well, I'm gonna roll that again because duplicates are no fun. Didn't work. Estimated time until playing. What? Forty-four minutes. Skip. What? <laughs> what? Don't worry. Don't look at the behind the thing. Okay. Fuck it. Here, let me find. I'll find. No, 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 I'll get songs. Don't worry. Just keep. You do the DMing. <laughs> okay, okay. So, as you exit the mysterious room, you find yourself at the edge of a just barren landscape with a racetrack stretching off into the distance. And at the beginning of the racetrack are four different go karts. With enough room to fit four people in each. I call driving! <laughs> Do it! Get in there! Those wagons uh, He runs and jumps into the driver's seat. Oh god. Must be magical. Horses. And out of nowhere, goggles just seemingly appear on his eyes. Yes, I'm okay with this. Less okay about this. Well, how did you pet him the turn order thing? So uh, click on the little cogwheel. And it should, uh, like, bring up, like, a little menu that says, and just, like, put them in descending order. Beautiful. All righty. And then if you click on that little arrow, it'll cycle through the initiative. Ah, perfect. Okay, so before you guys can even start getting your cars, the bald-headed man and his gaggle of horrific abominations are already speeding down the track. They're not even using one of the cars. They're just running. <laughs> I think that can would be cheating. That? But... I think it's also really cool. You hear this booming voice from the man before. All competition is legal. It's hard to break the rules in quadruple quandary. <laughs> and next up, it is Palouse. So wait. So, so what are we doing? Is initiative. It... You're, ra you're racing cars. to the next part of the. Yeah. Okay. What do I got to roll? You already rolled initiative. But I oh, think I should have gone. But... Well, really Palouse, Palouse gets to the car first. Do you start driving it? Y yeah. yeah. Um, do I know how? 
You get to decide. Does have vehicle permission? You decide. If, 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 if a giant character like Palouse like controls the car, we're gonna have poor handling and low acceleration. Hey, hey I, I had a nice initiative. I'm pretty sure I'm in the driver's seat. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, John is oh. actually there. Yeah. But, but I'm first. John was too slow to roll initiative. Yeah, but he's Here, 19. Let me, do, let me do like this. You can't but drive, Sam was darling. Too slow. Okay, so you guys are all already moving. You're all already in the cars, racing on the track, and the ball headed man's in front. You guys are in second. The Chads are in third, and the Strahds are in fourth. So now it is Palooza's turn. What do you do? I throw a banana. I don't know. What, what do what it. Can I... <laughs> no, 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 no. Play some Mario Kart music. <laughs> yeah, throw a banana. Do it. Okay, so I found a banana in inside of the car that we're in and yeah i eat it i do I, I you know i uh smush it and so the banana just comes out and then i throw the peel awesome all right that uh that gets in the way of the chads right behind you Let me... is there any rules for this oh not really we're just winging it oh and the chads <laughs> the chads because the chads fight. fucked up badly they are careening back to fourth place, and the Strats are oh. coming up behind, behind you guys now. Ooh! But now it's the Chad's turns. Let's see what they do. You can make it a skills challenge. <laughs> Did they pick up a, a, a item box? Quest that next round we achieve ramming speed. <laughs> All right, they are uh, keeping steady. They're gaining on the strides in front of them, but they're not really making that much progress. A very, very neutral roll. All right, on to our... Uh, okay, so uh, let's see. We've got Weird Dude and his horrible creatures up ahead. Uh, I'm going to cast Hold Person on all of them. Ooh, do it. <laughs> okay. Just, uh, that. Uh, should I do an Arcana check or just cast a spell? Your choice, baby. Uh, Arcana check it is. Uh -huh. It's Ted. Of uh, the the paralyzing magic shoots forward and it reflects <laughs> off of the bald man's head oh. as it polished <laughs> to a chrome like sheen. <laughs> On to agony, sir. I have an idea. I have an idea, darling. How about we just uh, make ourselves bigger and large on our cart and all of us? <laughs> oh dang! Let's do an arcana check. Fuck it. Holy shit! What the fuck. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so you get kind kind of bigger, but not that much bigger. <laughs> it's it's you're getting a little closer to the horrific beast in front of you, but not much not that much closer. Hey, if you want to make us bigger, you have to work the crankshaft. No, not like that. No, anyway, no, I, it's I haven't I haven't done it on some this many things at once. That's this big. Mm-hmm. <laughs> what the fuck right. is going on? <laughs> All right, onto the strads. And as you guys are driving, you guys feel like everything kind of stopped moving for a second. And you hear someone yelling in angry Japanese. But <laughs> as soon as things are moving again, the strads are now in a neck with the horrific what? beast in front of you. Uh, what the heck? Don't no. ask. John, John, step <laughs> on the... Weirdo. Step on Fucking it. Vampire. Make the horse, the invisible horses go faster. Got it! John! <laughs> Ramming speed! <laughs> Invisible horses! We're in a go-kart. <laughs> we're, we're in this little cart here with the power- with obviously a hundred invisible horsepower. In this fucking Harry Potter, what's going on? <laughs> you see some uh, translucent floating boxes sometimes on the track within an arm's reach. Just throw that out there. <laughs> With little question Completely. marks on them. <laughs> exactly, yeah. I'm going to and then you put your hand out and it glass shatters and fucking. Yes, <laughs> it's, it's horrific. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, ramming speed. What's that look like? Um. <laughs> I hit the gas as hard as I can and just drive straight at an enemy. Strength check? Let's, let's, um, let's call that. Whatever you want to call it. But more importantly, who are you ramming? <laughs> the Sonic crew. Alright, roll for it. Get them, Don John, Don get them! Um 
I don't, um... Let's call it an attack. Oh, that's great. Yes. Alright, so the animals turn around to look at you. The strange, kind of portly red one especially is going to give you some googly eyes. And they're distracted, and they start to slow down. <laughs> they're now side by side with you guys. And it is their turn now. The uh, the bully man takes out a little whip and starts whipping the abomination. He's like, don't get distracted. Keep going. For <laughs> <laughs> it is mildly successful. They're, they get back a little ahead of you guys, but they're still not catching up with the strods. Pulus is... Pulus, what do you do? Um... Um... Grab that big box thingy over there, darling. We're about to pass it. Quick, grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it! I... <laughs> it looks important. Throw my javelin in front of one of the other carts. Oh, Hell yeah, go for it. <laughs> hoping that it'll kill their invisible horses. <laughs> yeah, do it. Which one are you throwing in front of? Uh, Strauss or first. Sonic? Oh, the Strahd. Yeah, Strahd. <laughs> Athletics. Hell yeah. So, the javelin <laughs> lands in front of them, and it just, they drive right into it, and oh, yeah, they right. flip. They do just straight up a flip as the, you know, they ram into the javelin. But thankfully, they all turn to bats and right the car just in time, but they're still behind you guys now. So now, <laughs> the Sonics are in front. Alright, now it's time for the chat! <gasps> All right, they they take their arms out of the side of the car and they start just dragging the ground, just slapping it like Flintstone style. <laughs> they, 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 they shove their legs through the bottom of the car and start trying to Flintstone it. Oh fuck! It's it's okay. <laughs> They're keeping up. They're keeping up. They're neck and neck with the Strahds now, and now it's up to Artemis' sir. Okay. Uh, so let's see, the Sonic people are still ahead of us. Um, hmm. Let's see, what can I do here? Now, if I do that, it'll push them. Uh, oh, you know what? I'll use uh, Deception. I'm just going to make the sound of uh, like a character getting hit and like dropping all their rings in Sonic. See if that like <laughs> shakes the, like, like triggers some PTSD. <laughs> Makes it turn around. Yeah. <laughs> you gotta get the coin. Oh. Gotta get the, gotta get oh. the rings. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's perfect. All three of the horrific abominations turn around and start heading towards the coins, leaving the, the bald man just skidding on the ground, just skidding all the way back to fourth. You guys are in the lead now. Ah! Uh... Yes. <laughs> right now it's Agony's turn. Uh, I'll, I'll turn back towards all of them, and I'll pull out my liquid spite. And... <laughs> Take that, suckers! This is for the sponsors! And I'll, like, flash him with my boobs and, like, shake the spite and just, like, fucking open okay. it at them into their faces. You hear the booming voice of Rob Marker in the in the air again. That's right, folks! Liquid spite for when you need to spray that sprite on your phone! And add, add plus five to whatever you're gonna roll. Okay. Oh, shit! Oh, hell yeah! It, 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 it just blinds the chads the chads just they they just go completely off the road they they're dead their car explodes they're dying now. <laughs> well, that's and what that's i what call those eliminating the competition all right and now it's to the straight what i was gonna say virgins <laughs> and they're like no <laughs> but it's okay if you are uh -uh. <laughs> All right, the Strahds, the Strahds, they all transform into large, hulking demon beasts, kind of like the end of Castlevania 1, because that's the oh, reference. Fuck. And they're going to try <laughs> and leap forward to you guys. Oh, shit. Uh. And, oh, it gets into second place, but it's not quite enough. It's over to John. This is, you can see the end of the track in sight. You just push the metal. What do you do, John? Um, I would like to hand Paylus a item? I'm going to give him a projectile that I have in my inventory called an owl bear egg. <laughs> <laughs> and then I'm going to hit the gas. 
What do you do with it? The loot. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> we'll wait till my turn. Are you guys are you guys are maintaining no. that lead. Mm -hmm. And is that, is that all you want to do? Yes. Right. It's back to the back to the animals. So and Kalus, you have an owl bear egg you can throw at an enemy. Okay. Sure. It's a rock. And unfortunately, the uh, horrific <laughs> animal abominations are still distracted by the coins. So the bald man's just just kind of kind of rolling. He's in last place still, but he's kind of still rolling more slowly. And it's gonna ball like shape. Now it's finally too loose. The so. demon like shrouds are gaining on you guys. You can see the end of the path coming up ahead. So, John, this will just explode and blind them, right? Of course. Okay. I throw it at the uh, vampires. Do it, roll. So, athletics again? Am I allowed to do it twice? Hell yeah. yeah. Why not? Fuck it. It splats, splats in their eyes, and yeah, they're, they're trying to wipe it off, and that just causes them to kind of go off track, and you guys are first place, and you find yourselves at the end of the racetrack. Congratulations! Blast, Blast again. Something awesome. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So we're all and... just wooting and woo! Yeah! High five! Yeah! Woo! I don't even know what we're doing, but I love it. I want to go again. <laughs> <laughs> and in front of you, you see the... You're at the cliff of a mountain now. And the mountain up top is glowing in strange neon lights. But there's no way to get up the mountain quite yet. Oh, no. But there is an entrance at the bottom of this mountain into the caves further in. You can see that there are spaces for other entrances delegated to the... Yes, delegated for other, you know competitors but since you got the first thing to go through the first door the obviously a better door mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, you see that the surviving races are catching up behind you but you guys have dibs on that first door well they're gonna have to go through the other so one so it looks like our goal is at the top of the mountain you hear, like hear rob marker's voice but yes that's where the game is being held cool we have to and hike I look at the mountain. Rest of the group and go, so is it cheating <laughs> if I just run up the side of the mountain? Because I'm pretty sure they said there's no cheating, and I'm not gonna just do that. I'm gonna run up the side of the mountain. <laughs> I have spider climb slippers. That's <laughs> right. Buggy, what do we do? Uh, do I'll, I'll cast fly on Palouse and myself. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> Calm down. Remember, they said there's no such thing as cheating! <laughs> okay, police, you grab Agony. We'll just fly up there along with John. Fuck these doors. I feel a sudden need to make one million gold. <laughs> <laughs> just gotta hit that dollar twice. <laughs> Go to this not shady website. Pay four dollars. <laughs> Uh, so you guys are all flying now. Well, so Palouse and I'm flying. I'm running up the side. <laughs> and what is agony? Uh, I'm Palouse holding. I'm grabbing. Yeah, grab me. Yep. Alrighty. So you guys so are. You guys are ascending so up the side of the mountain. Superman. <laughs> when in the distance you see a strange sight of, well, it seems to be bulky humanoids. Sitting on clouds, holding fishing rods, slowly kind of <laughs> zooming towards you guys. Uh -oh. And as they grow closer, you can tell that they are turtles, large turtle humanoids. <laughs> and they are rearing their fishing rods to fling them at you guys. Um, um... The does anyone hell? have any lightning? I don't know any lightning spells. Um... I, no? Hold on, I know something. I know how to fix this problem. Uh, and I cast visibility. <laughs> God damn it, John. <laughs> Whose side is uh, that? How, like, how far away are we from, uh, from our destination? Um, the top of the mountain is a few hundred feet in the air. It is a tall mountain. Can all these turtles be, look, look, uh, Regis filming? Yes, they they have they have very wrinkly ghoulish faces that still have yet a charming smile. 
Perfect. And can I just shoot them with Eldritch Blast as we fly? Absolutely. <laughs> I will shoot them with Ray what? of Frost to also slow them down. I am just double dashing oh at 90 feet around straight up this thing. <laughs> Invisibly. Invisible Alright, so. <laughs> I'll say that uh, both Ultra Blasts hit, but I'm Susan's... To, like, <laughs> shoot while holding on. Not working. In fact, let me, let, me gra let me make a... Let me craft a token real quick for this thing I just had to invent. God. <laughs> <laughs> I can't do this on more than one occasion. Are you gonna cut out Regis's face and put it on a turtle? Uh, I wish I had time for that, but I can't. I was just planning... Oh, I've He's already... Gonna make it lack it too. <laughs> I was gonna do that, but I found a perfect region, perfect picture of Regis Fillman. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> one moment while I make this token. <laughs> oh, one moment, please. <laughs> <laughs> this is the internet. There might well, be a Regis Fillman turtle out there. While uh, while Kyle's doing that, we'll cut to a commercial break. Uh, we see Artemis coming yes. out of a church, dressed in like groom attire. With four different women in wedding dresses escorting him. Uh, people are smiling, laughing, they're throwing rice in celebration. He once won a beauty contest that he didn't enter. We see a blindfolded Artemis like throw a pair of dice over his shoulder onto a gaming table. Uh, he turns around, removing the blindfold to find the dice have landed on two sixes. Uh, as a beautiful woman like kisses him, and a dealer like pushes a pile of money at him. He once rolled a natural 20 on a 12-sided die. And then we see Artemis, like, declaring checkmate in a game of chess with a mind flayer while hanging upside down by his feet. Devils make deals with him. He is the most interesting man in the realms. I don't always drink cola, but when I do, I prefer heck of cola. Stay thirsty, suckers. Okay, next commercial. Get plus five to your next roll. All right, next commercial. You see, uh, you see Palouse... Just kind of uh, getting out of the shower. He's in his towel. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> you know, I used to have a lot of problem with all this fur. But I feel I feel more progressive. And now I have woke razors. Woke razors have really changed my life. It's the best a person could get. And you see him and he starts shaving all of his fur off. <laughs> That's horrifying. <laughs> Plus five. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna say there's a, there's six of these. <laughs> oh god. Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> when did Regis Fulman ever have that face? <laughs> Oh, Why did he make an expression? Because someone <laughs> Why are they so big? He said so it's a big turtle man. Features, dude. Someone caught face. him on the shitter. Should have been some guys trying to climb up the mountain instead of going inside the cave. Uh, Should have gone through the cave. Listen, we were told there were no rules. I blame John for this. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. Just keep going. All right, Who's so you, uh... John person you're talking about? I see no one like that around. John, or... when I find you, I'm gonna kill you. All right, so you shot... You gotta find me first! <laughs> Marco! All right. Volo. <laughs> Not you, Artemis. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Looking for... All right, so... You did two Eldritch Blasts. Were they at the same one or two different ones? Uh, same one. Alrighty, yeah, that we're going to roll damage. Uh, so five for the first, and uh, nineteen for the second. So twenty-four. All right, that's a dead Regis. All right, man, let, <laughs> let's, I'll just roll for initiative real quick. <laughs> I don't think we're going back initiative this quickly. <laughs> uh, it's a shit show. Let's go. Uh, and we'll just use the re we'll just use the uh, initiative we're on before. Okay. Okay, Fine. you have to go into the settings and clear out the old one. Wait, he, he said same. Uh, you have to do the same as all. Yeah, we'll do the same as you have before. Fuck it. <coughs> Alrighty. Regis film. I should be first, then. 
Who wants to be a millionaire? But don't worry, my turn is spent running. Okie dokie, so your turn is spent running is now the Regis's turns is... Well, so, bonus <laughs> action dash, you know, so I'm... And then I'm also action dodging, just in case! Okie dokie, so, all that's visible is just Artemis and John way up high and... No, John okay, is and invisible. John... Okay, so you're definitely not on the targeting thing. Okay, so... So really, it's just Palouse and Arms. Let me roll some one d. And me on the back of Palouse. <laughs> John's decision was I'm going to run, uh, just in case someone does see me. I'm going to dodge. Just okay, the fir the first Regis is targeting Arm. Oh shit! Does twenty hit your armor with his fishing line? Uh, yeah, I suppose if you wanted to. All right, so the hook hook catches on you, and he rears it back and flings you downward. Ah! <laughs> Artemis. It's okay, he's still flying. Yeah, I'm still flying. <laughs> All right, next one. Oh shit! Uh, wait, no, lots of them. All right, the next one is also targeting Artemis. <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> Can you say some Regis line? Who wants to be back on the fucking ground? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Alright. I'd like to phone a friend! Alright, this one gets you with his hook and is... Now he's just dragging you back towards Earth. Ugh. I always like Kathy Lee better. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, our third Regis is now targeting Palouse. Oh, gods. Okay. What was, the, what was the roll? It was, uh, I think I typed it in the wrong. It missed. It missed. <laughs> I would say it misses. Well, okay. that's not actually a roll, because you didn't have it set up ah, to me. That's true. Great, roll it, roll it. Roll it. Alright, 12. There you go. I think that actually misses. I think my DC or my AC is 13. Alrighty, yeah, the hook goes by your shoulder, not not connected with you at all. Please go faster, go faster. You are, you are better on the morning show. <laughs> all right, our fourth Regis is targeting <laughs> Artemis again. Fuck. Oh. Jesus Christ! I guess I'm destined to oh, be my, on the my, fucking my ground. My internet's pooping us off right now. You guys all choppy. Okay, it looks like they hit me again. Dragging me still to the ground. <laughs> Down the mountain. I don't know. Okay, I think things have evened out again. Okay, so yeah, it, 25, I assume that... Yeah, oh totally. Okay, I would say that at this point he... This one has dragged you back to the ground. Wait, like, <sighs> to the beginning. <laughs> and... That's how for our last re- <laughs> Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> it's <just> zero B. <laughs> this one... <laughs> It, it shoots out its its a uh, its fishing roll at you, fishing pull at you, and it hooks you. And this time, it just kind of nudges you towards the cave entrance. Then it flies back up. <laughs> Fucking. Wait, we're supposed to do Dragon. this as a team. Yeah, I just double dashed and ran another whatever feat. And now it is Palooza's turn. I'm gonna grab another javelin and throw it at one of them while I'm flying up. Do it. Throw, uh, yeah. Uh. Mm -hmm. Alright, that hits. Roll, roll for damage. 
Do you get your uh, divine uh, fury thing on there? That's only no, if I'm actually he's, raging. He's not raging. I haven't. So. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. Declare that. <laughs> no. Alrighty. I do get two attacks. I mean, I can roll again. Yeah, go for it. Like he's a uh, still hurt. Still is hurt. That one is. All right. That's enough to knock one of them off his cloud, and <laughs> <laughs> he falls towards Artemis. Oh God, it's Artemis! He falls, <laughs> falls towards Artemis. Artemis, roll a dexterity. Oh, just, just fucking turtle killing our turtle towards her. <laughs> Boom. Oh, wow. Ooh, that's good. And also, sock slowly, softly floating after this Akuto, this Regis, is the cloud he was on. Also, the, the Regis landed on his back. You heard a sickening crack. He's dead. No biggie. <laughs> but his cloud is slowly floating down by its... Over to your turn. Uh, I'll pick up that the, the shell of the dead Regis and I'll, fl I'll hop on the cloud and fly up. <laughs> All right, go for it. It's a yeah. it is a speedy cloud. They were using it kind of slow, but it is a speedy cloud. You can catch back up with Palouse and the gang. Pretty. As I do. I, I yell, "Go, Nimbus!" <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and as go. I'm uh, riding up, uh, let's see. So we got four of these assholes left. Uh, yep, Elders yep. blast. Do it. Okay. First one. Uh, eighteen and uh, third. 18? Um, 8 will hit, 13 won't. Okay. Pew! For, uh, wow, 13 damage. 13? That's just enough, and it pops another one off his cloud. Drag me to the ground, assholes. <laughs> right. Not so funny when I do it. We're just trying to enforce the rules. Got there rules are right no here. rules! <laughs> oh, you hear the voice of the shell of the no rules. You hear the voice of Rob Marker in there. It's kind of inconsistent. <laughs> That's Fuck the you, beauty Rob of quadruple quandary. <laughs> A puzzle, isn't it? And is that your turn? Yeah. Over to Agony. Mostly just curious what you're on and if I can have some. Is it not? Is it Jiagra? Oh, you know it. Oh God. <laughs> Been on Would it for like longer it? than four hours. <laughs> oh, you know it. <laughs> you should really contact your local cleric. <laughs> I'm never going off it. <laughs> this is my life now. <laughs> but that's the life of quadruple quandary. <laughs> I get it. I do. Uh, good thing I'm not a cleric. Whose turn is it? Agony? Is <laughs> yes. Um. This is mad. I do not want these terrifying creatures getting on us again. I'm just going to try and fucking fireball all of them. You know what? That's okay. I'm okay with that. Go I'm, for it. I'm okay. I, yeah, 29. Deck saves. Let me, let me roll the deck. They're, they are not fast turtles. They really rely on those clouds, but roll them. <laughs> uh -oh. It's because they're all reaches. Mm. <laughs> oh, yeah. They fail it. Yeah. They... Oh, fuck. <laughs> You smell the delicious taste of turtle soup. <laughs> I'll Tonight watch you will die. If you want to come back and scoop up the remains of the Reaches, you you absolutely may. <laughs> I don't know if I want. It to. tastes like dollar bills. That's disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty. <laughs> <laughs> so, you guys continue up the mountain with your clouds, your spider walking boots, and your fly spells and everything, and you find yourselves at a nice ledge that is... Let me go and take it to the next... How are the other teams looking? Oh, they're having, the next, to, next area? they're having to go through the caves and everything. <laughs> Suckers. Alrighty. <laughs> And you find yourselves near the peak of the... Oh, you hear this voice appear in the air again. Welcome to the Suffering Summit! Just see suffering John standing summit. there next to you guys going, Hey, how's your trip? Fuck off. Not bad, actually. I got dragged by turtles. You got you a nice like cloud that sounds like it? you might have been something you deserved? Oh, no. Let me get out of this. I'm gonna fucking kill you. <laughs> you You've said that before. 
multiple times. Guys, be quiet. This is serious. It is. We can bend. Oh, you. the stars are here. <laughs> yes, the caves were. We we saw that you guys had tried to cheat the system by climbing up the mountain, and we decided to use our bat forms to do the same. See, it works <laughs> out, didn't it? Mm. There's rules. What I to explain to my allies here. It's not cheating. There are no rules. Now it seems that it's just between you and us for to get to the summit, eh, buddies? Ha <laughs> ha! Why, yes. Ha <laughs> ha Yes, um, quite. Is there any There's only room for one dashing dark anti-hero here. And that's me. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> I'm a strong dog! Quite, quite, friend. Quite, my angry, <laughs> angry foreign friend. <laughs> As you guys have gone closer to the summit, you notice that the winds and the hail and the studio lights are getting more intense. <laughs> intense enough to keep you from being able to fly <laughs> up any further. You're going to climb the rest of the way. Oh, you like see, at the <laughs> see, at the very top of the suffering summit, the rock is glowing with some particles that are shooting upward towards a hole in the ceiling. They can just barely notice. In effect, everyone roll me perception check. Oh, fuck. Uh... There's a ceiling? Oh, I have a perfect idea for this. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so the entire, air, the entire arena, including the ceiling, shakes for a moment and it grows a little darker. But, John, you're the only one who notices some hand-like shapes kind of appear over the ceiling, almost like it's translucent for a moment. Some large, like, claw-like shapes <laughs> up in the up in the sky. Yeah. Almost like it's a silhouette blocked by something up above. Oh, I was thinking it was going to be a white glove. <laughs> Play Smash Bros. Then... No, wait, <laughs> that's the final boss, sorry. <laughs> And then you hear the voice of Rob Marker again. All right, time to ascend the Suffering Summit. The first one to the top gets to join our final games. And this is a skill challenge. Let's go ahead and get some new initiative. Oh, my. Let me clear this real quick. All right, question. Artemis, John, um, which one of you would make the better damsel? Clearly, John. <laughs> and he's blinking and winking, like trying to giggle yeah. the best he can. You're definitely right. <laughs> yeah, Artemis. Mm. Yeah, no, uh, definitely Too John. I mean, I didn't say that. The loose fair king joins the battle. <laughs> I am every, I am every parent's perfect child. <laughs> perfect, perfect. It's decided then. I am the dream every parent wishes for. <laughs> yeah. You're very, very right. Guys, John. what's your text for Smash? The loose eats the competition. Uh, I can't think of anything fast enough. <laughs> uh, let's see. John's is blurted out because it wasn't allowed for the rating that we are currently <laughs> under. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Uh, uh, Artemis, uh, Artemis Black rolls into action, and like, like it, it's sort of it appears behind a pair of falling dice. And sort of roll past. Dig it. All right. So it. this is a skill <laughs> challenge. I'm sure you all are familiar with. You're actually <laughs> using rules this time com compared to our race. And oh, good. <laughs> <laughs> all right. <laughs> So, Palouse, you're up, you're at the bottom of the Suffering Summit. The straws are on the other side of the mountain, trying to climb up themselves. Oh, am I supposed to be doing something? Um, I climb. <laughs> Can I do that? Yeah, hell yeah. <laughs> okay. Is that good? Boom, success. Yeah, boy. Alrighty. <laughs> that looks like a success to me. It's a fucking yellow block. Hell yeah. <laughs> Next up, agony. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna I'm gonna twin uh Palouse and Artemis here into giant apes. 
Uh, yeah, I'm spending spell slots for that. <laughs> All right, well, give advantage. <laughs> and they will climb us up to the top, fucking King Kong style. You get advantage. Uh, wait, what? Uh, Ar Arcana. Arcana. Ar yeah, Arcana. <laughs> You know, Fifteen dozen. <laughs> yeah, we're just being carried. Palouse grabs me while he's climbing. <laughs> Asher. Artemis right. grabs John. John looks beautiful. Mm -hmm. All right, next up is <laughs> Artemis, and as just as you guys turn a giant ape, you see out of a compartment, out of a out of the floor from the top, another giant ape appears. And behind him, there's a stacks and stacks of barrels. He is oh, plummeting shit. barrels down at you guys. <laughs> oh, <fuck. laughs> oh, guys, I'm good at this. Run, 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 jump, and then climb the ladder. Jump over uh, the barrel. I'm bar going to use sleight of hand to try and catch one of those barrels and throw it back at him. Go for it. Oh, oh that's, that, I'm going to spend a luck point. Go for oh. it. Oh! oh. <laughs> it's not I throw bad. John at it. <laughs> <laughs> they just decided. <laughs> All right, yeah. You uh, reach out a hand to grab one of the barrels. It just shatters on your hand, cover you in splinters. But you're already throwing as it happens. You lob John forwards. Speaking of, John... Um, I currently look like a fair maiden. So I am going to go, hey, vampy boys! And then I'm gonna take some fake blood out of my makeup kit and just spurt it all over myself. Gross, love it. Let's do it. <laughs> so I'll do performance. Uh, that is just enough. Just barely enough. I like this basketball we have here. <laughs> trying to help you out with the skills challenge, I don't know. <laughs> oh, it's, 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 I, I, I appreciate it, thank you. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that one's not a basketball, that's an anarchy symbol. <laughs> Even better. No, that's the smash symbol right there. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You're right. <laughs> Alright, on Back to Strahd and the Strahds. They see this blood-covered maiden, and they are trying to concentrate on not just going towards our blood cover John and concentrate on climbing. Let's see. They do poorly. They do poorly and they just start chasing after John away from the top of the mountain. Like kind of success for you guys, why not? Alright, over to Palooza's turn. Your giant ape. Um I'm going to shit in my hand and throw it at the other group. <laughs> Do it! Hell yeah! <laughs> the other I think hand. that's an intimidation check? Uh. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> oh. <Fuck. laughs> Shit. They, they, they are not intimidated. They're used to it. They like it. They're guano. It's their, uh... <laughs> Oh, yes, Guano, just like the caves back in Barovia. <laughs> yes, I see you have an appreciation for the medicinal purposes of Guano yourself. Fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> All right, anything else you want to do with your turn? Or... No, that'll be it. I'll, All I'll right, I'll try to move if I can. All right. Oh, you guys are, yeah, you guys are assumed to be moving over to Agony. Uh, so I don't have any other kind of propulsion system that I can think of. So I'm going to pull another ball bottle of liquid spite out from between my breasts. And I'm going to open it up. <laughs> put some garlic in it. Shake it up. <laughs> and fucking make the garlic just spout onto all the fucking straws over there. <laughs> and you get plus five to that for brand... For brand... Brand, brand propulsion. Branding. Sure. Yes. Uh, Sponsorship. Sponsorship. What the fuck do I roll for this fucking shit? I don't fucking know. It's sleight hand. Hell yeah! <laughs> they, they see the spray of liquid spider. Oh yes, refreshing liberty lime goes wet. Is that garlic <laughs> I smell? Oh no! <laughs> the, the 
the one the blonde hair is just screeching. Yeah. <laughs> They're writhing in agony. That's what I do best, darling. <laughs> all right, you guys are almost there. Over to Armistice turn again. Uh, okay, so I, it, it's a little hard to read this thing. How many successes do we have? <laughs> you need three more. I have no idea. Okay. Um, uh, let's see. I'm going to use... Uh, let's see. Uh, bu -bu -bu -bum. Uh, let's see. I'm still a giant monkey. Oh, you know what? Um, uh, I'll use Insight trying to time some of those barrels, uh, trying to predict their uh, the, art, the trajectory of the uh, barrels so I can strategically jump over them. Hell yeah. Uh. Insight. There we go. You nailed it. You were jumping over these barrels like a champ. High high score. One up, one up, one up, one up. It's beautiful. Love it. Okay, we need two more successes over to John. Um, okay. I am going to... Just now that the vampires have are chasing me, just outrun them and try and, you know, acrobatically dodge and jump and get them to hopefully fall into a trap. Hell yeah. You did it. You, you nailed it. <laughs> you are hopping around. They're falling into traps. It's going fantastic. And oh, it's over to the Strahd's turn. Oh shit. They try to turn into bats again so they can just fly over the rest of the obstacle. What? Let's see if there's strong enough bats to, to make it work. If they succeed, do we get a failure? Or a success? Oh, they failed. <laughs> you guys get a success, and you guys are about to hit the top. Alright. You guys won. Yeah! Yeah! Okay. You guys, are surround you guys are surrounding the summit of Suffering Summit. And <sighs> the top, very top is glowing with an unearthly power. You think there's some kind of magical artifact here? You hear the voice of Rob Marker booming above. Go on, touch it! Enter the final game room. So is this like a sure? Like a mysterious voices tell me to touch things. I never doubt it, and I'll just go yeah, ahead. We and all touch it. At the Wait, same we have time. to touch it at the same time, or we're fucked. We've not seen Harry it's Potter. Just like Harry Potter. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Well, you better hurry, because he's already halfway to towards touching. John. It. <laughs> we all touch all it at the same three. time. One. On three, we all touch it at the same time. Okay. 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 One. One. Two. two. Three! Touch. I touch it. Uh. Alright. <laughs> and you find yourselves in a giant showroom. And just beyond the maps, Reach is just stands and stands of audience members filled with with fairies and demons and devils. All, all manner of strange beasts. They're all cheering for you. They're all just hooting with excitement. And let me drag Bob Marker onto here. I really wish Sablin could have been here for this. Uh, while, uh, while that's happening, uh, we'll cut to another commercial break. Uh, uh, we see like Artemis standing behind a counter with a bottle of colored liquid and some like stained shirts on it. Hi, Artemis Black here for Elusiclean, the Stain Obscure. Are you tired of stains, spills, and splatters ruining your treasure belongings? Elusiclean hides, all, hides it all away. Artemis pours some liquid onto a hand towel powered by illusion magic. Just rub a little illusion clean on it, and presto, the stain completely vanishes. It's safe on clothes, and he rubs some on John's stained shirt. It works on armor, and I rub it on, like, Sableland's muddy armor. It works on pet stains and smells. Cut a boat in half. Cut a boat in half. <laughs> uh, Artemis, like, he cuts a boat in half with some of the stuff, and, uh... Cleans up like a discolored patch uh, of carpet in front of police. <laughs> Even red wine is no match for the stain disguising power of Illusa Clean. He just pours a glass of red wine into Agony's cleavage and goes in to like rub it away. We cut to Artemis standing behind the counter, this time with a black eye and his arm in a sling. But wait, if you order right now, we'll throw in a second bottle of Illusa Clean, a 15 silver piece value, absolutely free. Just pay shipping and handling. So what are you waiting for? Get Illusa Clean today. Beautiful. 
Absolutely beautiful. So this is so great. I got a boat in half. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's Mel the that's Mel the Steel. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. So there's a, another commercial. Um, it's Palouse again. He's sitting in a room. It's dark. It's ominous. And you see him, and he uh, he has like a a needle. And he he starts injecting it into his body. And it says heroin. <laughs> and then it, then it says, then it says depression. <laughs> and like letters as it floats up to the top. <laughs> and it says, all can be cured. And then it shows the woke razor. We go to the next commercial break, and there's John. <laughs> Yeah. Standing in a kitchen, <laughs> and he's holding a frying pan, and he goes, and there's an egg just sitting on the counter, and he goes, this is your brain. He takes the frying pan, full force, swings it down, smashes it. This is your brain on drugs. <laughs> <laughs> Do drugs, kids? Absolutely. <laughs> Who doesn't just want that mind bashing experience? <laughs> uh, we, we cut to like a like a, a, a gener like a generic park, uh, and Artemis and, and the rest of the gang are just sort of walking through it, like flying kites, throwing frisbees for Palouse to catch. You know, just sort of like generic Sunday afternoon yeah, stuff. Yeah, no, I catch it in my mouth. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and just a voiceover. <laughs> voiceover all of this. You're an adventurer. You like crawling through dungeons, fighting monsters, finding treasure. But when tragedy strikes, uh, you could find yourself suffering from resurrectile dysfunction. Life. Resurrectile dysfunction is a serious medical condition that will affect three out of five adventurers under the level of eight. <laughs> Symptoms may include stiffness, decomposition, and loss of life. But now there's an answer. Revivify. Revivify is a third level non-ritual spell. In clerical trials, Revivify was proven to alleviate symptoms of resurrectile dysfunction in just under one minute. Revivify is not a reincarnation. Adventurers should not use Revivify if they are decapitated, disemboweled, or trapped in a prison demiplane. Do not use Revivify in conjunction with other revitalizing magic. If after using Revivify, you feel numbness, dizziness, a hunger for living flesh, or have suddenly multiclassed, consult your cleric immediately, as they may be signs of serious complications. Adventurers take all kinds of turns, but when they turn deadly, turn to Revivify. Uh... Oh, I'm loving all these. I'm actually going to take a I'm gonna take a ten minute break real quick, and we'll come to the final show. Uh, Bring it. Okay. You to go find dessert. I'll be back in at eight forty six my time. So ten ten, ten four from wherever your time is. It's okay. I have cake. Want some cake?
Yo, everybody still here? Yeah, I'm listening. Can yeah, I'm actually gonna have to... Noise. I'm actually gonna have to call it early. Something just came up. <gasps> so... What happened? Um, someone I used to work with like a few years ago just died. I'm just hearing about it, so... Oh, shit. Gonna Holy go shit. see what's up with that. Fuck. Sorry about calling yeah. this short. Oh, oh that's okay. okay, man. Yeah, totally. Yeah, that's kind of understandable. Yeah, yeah, that's horrible. Yeah, I haven't I heard from this guy. In... Yeah, like, Jesus Christ, yeah. I will I'm talk sorry. to you guys later. Yeah, yeah, go. Yeah, sorry again for cutting it short. No, no, Bye. no worries, no man. Worries. Yeah. Well, we can, uh, 